fighting fit and fit to fight is how the army puts it. And if you want to go a soldiering, you'd better not be afraid to get your feet wet. Cross-country running is one of the many ways of toughening up the troops and building much needed powers of physical stamina. A system of graded exercises helps to limber them up and quickly develops athletic agility and perfect muscular control. Army physical instructors are, of course, all highly qualified teachers. Incidentally, you might like to have a shot at this after a night out at those other parallel bars, the ones along each side of the main street. If you want something with more of a punch to it, here it is. Of the many sports organized by the army, boxing is probably the most popular. It is good training for soldiers whose business it is to cut up rough at the right moments. As you probably know, army boxers have captured many national and other championships. But not all the men take to the ring. Some prefer swimming. They say it's got more of a kick to it. In this indoor swimming pool at the Curra, reckoned to be one of the best in the country, by the way, they learn to use arms and legs to the best possible effect, under expert instruction. And here, too, the army very often leads the nation, producing swimmers such as Cadet Aragon, seen here practicing to defend his title as national backstroke champion. Well, we warned you not to join the army if you didn't want to get your feet wet. Swimming in full battle dress with rifle is part of a soldier's training. <laughs> 